Well, believe it or not, it's the first day of school at Camarina Elementary School in Chula Vista. And let's get out to Brad Perry right now to tell us all about it. Brad, what's going on? You're ready to do a dance. Oh, yeah, I think I'm doing the dance for the mom and dads right now uh, and also for the kids, too. A lot of dancing going on here. Uh, and that was the uh, all the kids are back in school dance for the parents. And then the kids are like, we have a new school. We have a new school, which is great. Anthony, come on in here. This is How wonderful. How are you doing this morning? We're doing great, Brett. First day of school in a brand new elementary school right here in Chula Vista. Yes, very exciting day for uh, not only the, the students, but the uh, community of Chula Vista, the community of Winding Walk in particular. Uh, this is the first school in our district since 2007. Uh, it's a showcase of technology, energy efficiency, and most important, uh, teaching and learning. Yeah, and what's also very exciting, this is a walkable school now for a lot of the families here because usually they were bussed over or going to different schools, and that's right. one thing they were looking forward to when they moved down here to the community was yeah. able to walk to school. And when we just got done seeing everyone walking here to school. Yes, it's very exciting to build, a, you know, to have not only a walkable community, but a, a school where you can walk to safely and efficient, efficiently. Uh, we had students at, with their parents bicycling to school this morning. It was great to see, uh, great for the environment, a good healthy activity. So we strongly encourage uh, more of that. And it's a great way to take advantage of uh, our beautiful weather as well. Yeah, and it's very nice. Let's also talk about who the school is dedicated to because it's a yes. very important name up there. Well, we're very honored and proud of our affiliation with uh, the Camarena Foundation. Our school, our Board of Education, uh, chose uh, the name Enrique S. Camarena for this school after a very moving presentation. Uh, this school was named after someone who gave his life in service of the country and the war on drugs. And so it's a very sobering reminder of the human cost uh, of that war on drugs, uh, but also uh, a beacon of hope. Uh, that that um, incident sparked the Red Ribbon Week that uh, now occurs nationwide. So we're very honored uh, to have uh, his name address our newest school. Yeah, we're going to be going inside and seeing these new schools, but of course the kids are starting. Let's mention that because I know some people are going, wait, wait, why are kids going back to school? But we got to realize that you guys are on a different schedule than the San Diego Unified School District. Correct. Um, much of the South County actually is in school, is in session today. Today is the first day of class. It's a modified uh, school calendar, modified year-round calendar, if you will, and it's intended to help, uh, again, with retention. Uh, you give them too long of a summer break, studies show that they have to reteach in the beginning of the next school year. So we want them to hit the ground running. Uh, they're ready. They've had uh, almost seven uh, week uh, summer break and the excitement is again about the first day of school back at teaching and learning. So I like it. Of course, everyone's getting ready. Morning. Are you ready for the first day? Can I get the yes. high five? Yeah. Are you excited? Look, at, are you excited? You're excited. First day. Look at that. I like that. They're exci excited first day. Yeah, all right. So David and Alexis, a lot of kids are excited. The parents are. And of course, that, uh, you know, back to school dance that uh, someone will be doing. Look, he's already, you have your back to school dance for the kids, right? You got it? Yeah, I thought so. We come back, we're going to head to the classroom. We're going to see more of this wonderful school uh, that is uh, ready to go and open. Thank you, Brad. I'm sitting here talking to former Charger Darren Carrington. We both agree that's just wrong. It's still July. What are you doing going back to school? But I guess that's the way it works in so many areas.